It's the Hart Foundation. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 516 pounds. Jim Neidhart and Bret Hart, the Hart Foundation. A true Hall of Fame tag team when you look at Bret the Hitman Hart and Jim the Anvil Neidhart. Here come Hall and Nash. And their opponents, accompanied by Eric Bischoff, at a combined weight of 608 pounds, Kevin Nash and Scott Hall, the NWO. Multi-time tag team champions, one of the great factions in sports entertainment history. Change the game. Rash, bold, and not afraid to offend anyone. Outsiders making their presence known tonight. Two men who changed the business through attitude and cunning. These guys have two professional tenants. Beat people up and get paid accordingly. They ain't getting paid by the hour, as they say. We'll see how Nash and Hall fare here tonight. And they'll be facing off against one of the most iconic tag teams in WWE history, the Hart Foundation. The chemistry that Bret Hart and Jim Neidhart share in the ring is something most tag teams can only dream of. Well said. It's not just one thing that elevates the Hart Foundation to that upper echelon, but it's everything. You'd be hard-pressed to find a flaw in the game plan and execution of the Hart Foundation. Oh, what a strike to the back. A nice shot by Kevin Nash. In comes Scott Hall. Textbook Fireman's Carry Takeover. Neckbreaker! The Hitman looking to really get this one going now. All the way up. Sidewalk slam delivered. He breaks the ref's count before two. Not quite enough to put him away. Oh, God! Oh no, trapping the arm. Vicious stomps to the hand. Bam! Down he goes. We have Bret Hart on the defensive. And here's Hart sent flying and into a rough landing. Line. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Oh, enough already. Ah, striking with an A. Down to Bonin. And it's in the, the cover. cover. Fights the shoulder up at one. That's smart. Taking the one to catch your breath. Able to get the advantage here. Good lord. So a 
effective. Overwhelming offense now from Nash. Nash cannot be stopped right now. Yes, tag! Neidhart retaliates. Oh, goes tumbling to the outside. Bang! Oh, man. Boom! <laughs> Punch lands. He's absorbed some damage already. Oh, and a cheap shot right above the eye. Power slam. The anvil firing up, feeding off the energy in this match. And tag, he's in now. Finally. Powerless position to be in right now. Oh, man, right to the esophagus. Dominating shoulder tackle. Clubbing strike breaks up that move. Hip toss! And set right into the corner. Looking a little out of it, up on that turnbuckle. Uh -huh. Fellas, I think this one is about to end. I agree with you, Corey. Full away slam! Does he get it here? Come on, rep, keep these guys in check. Great reversal. Bam! Down he goes. Oh, look at his aggression, just oh. pure brutality. Come on, easy. Scott Hall getting put in check here. In the Anvil Neidhart strike hits the mark. Oh, an arm breaker. Well placed kick to the gut. Another damaging Bang. kick. Oh, and a close line to follow. Hall running into big trouble now. Hall's just trying to weather the storm. Right to the face. My God. Uh oh. Bill got caught with a reversal and a tag there. This is not going to end well for Nash's opponent. Epic choking ended here. Uh -huh. Teammate makes the save. And just in time. Showing out their deadlifting prowess and just tossing them aside. Ah, look at this, just cranking it out. Cranking the head. A bit of showmanship here from the big man. Kevin Nash about to establish his dominance. What a powerbomb. Nash has him on Dream Cover. Street. And he makes the save for his team. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh-oh, knees up. Just in time. Short jab. Raining down those shots to the back of the neck. Loving blows. What are they doing here? Reaches his partner for the tag. Slam. He's on his heels a bit now. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. And here's the tag. Scott Hall into the ring. And he gets delivered back into the ring. What a hot shot. It's all the way to the outside. Can the anvil come back from that? Two, 
guy clearly not sweating his opponent here. Double underhook applied. Butterfly suplex. He's able to beat a two count. Still going to take a massive effort to keep him down. Caught an elbow to the gut for that effort. And he sends him into the corner. Uh-oh, turning the tables. John Hall has got it right where he wants him. Up and... Outsider's edge from Scott Hall. Will Hall seal the deal? And there's the save. Hall is just adding insult to injury here. And out of the ring he goes. You have to imagine we're hitting the late stages of this matchup. Who's going to dig deeper at this point? It might just take that extra push, that extra inch further to create the difference. Blow to the bread basket. Scott Hall knocked him. This fight is going down right in front of our faces. More up close and personal than I'd like to be. Jim the Anvil Nightheart has taken a lot of damage. I'm not sure how much more he can take. Yeah, this is not good. You don't say, Saxton. Everyone needs to get out of the way of this fight. This feels so unsafe. And a big boot. Hart wasting no motion on the counter. Toss back into the ring. Got to find a way back into the ring now. Before the count runs out. He climbs back into the ring just in time. That was getting close. Uh-oh. Dropping the elbow right on the knee. Hits him with the counter. Tag is made. Jim the Anvil Knight to make this power. A nice power slam. Is there anything left in hole? And finally, finally, he picks up the victory. These gentlemen get after it. Here are the highlights. a victory for the team, especially Jim, the Anvil Nighthawk, who really helped put this one away. The Irish Ace ready for a fight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring. From Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 180 pounds, J.D. McDonough. J.D. McDonough is an Irish nobleman who walks with an air of distinction. And tonight, he's looking to throw hands. Yeah, McDonough's been on a rocket launch-like trajectory ever since entering NXT. He has these chilling eyes, just a stare, stares right through you. and. He's able to dismantle all comers. McDonough possesses skills so far beyond, you have no choice but to become a believer. J.D. McDonough is a competitor who changes the landscape wherever he competes. Listen, he'll attack if he senses even the slightest fear or trepidation. Hey, J.D. J.D., fear and trepidation to my left. Look at Saxton. Quiet, Corey. Time to feel the Grayson Waller effect. I'd rather not. And his opponent 
from Sydney, Australia, weighing in at 206 pounds, Grayson Waller. Already quickly risen through the ranks of NXT. Never afraid to pick a fight, though there's no guarantee he'll actually fight fair. You can make friends or you can make money in this business. And Waller's gonna make a lot of money. And here's Grayson Waller, a very divisive and very talented young superstar in my opinion. He rubs a lot of people the wrong way, but I find the honesty refreshing. He's in it for himself for the riches, for the spotlight. It won't get you a lot of love on social media, but the checks will cash, and to him, that's all that matters. Well, refreshing is one word for it. Nevertheless, we'll see if the soap he's got the shoulders down. And the shoulders up in time. We'll have to put in a little more work than that. McDonough wasting no motion on the counter. Corey, we've seen the incredible athletics of Grayson Waller and how quickly he can adapt. What's his opponent got to do to get the upper hand against Waller? You got to keep your head on a swivel with Waller. And not just because... Kohita clutch! Kohita clutch! Locked in! He's got it locked in! He may not have a choice. He may have to tap out! It is locked in. Wait, will it be? I think so! And he only stays down for a one count. He's still got life in this matchup. Oh, man, a little extra luster behind that kick. And JD gets out of the way. Oh, what a drop kick. On the mark. Watch the knee. Oh, disabling the leg with that. Cuts off the count in one. We are this far into the match. Where is this energy coming from? A picture perfect moonsault. And JD's keeping the pressure on. Waller unable to bend the rules just then, and his opponent found an opening. And JD gets that turn back on him. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Looked like JD's focus got rattled there. Yeah, Waller seemed like he was angling for a few extra zeros in the paycheck there. Alley-oop! Oh, he knew what was coming. Oh, yeah. my God, what an elbow. Lighten up the chest, and now... Straight to the knee. he's taken and yet he's still in this match yeah. wow somersault on Britier. is it enough the cover there's two this is no time to hesitate you can feel the end coming Set on the outside. Uh-oh. On the move. Take off. Boo-hoo. That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. Grayson is in big jeopardy here. Counter by Grayson. And he gets set back into the ring. Look at this. Oh, and a backbreaker. Right to the spine. Oh, super kick. Ireland's ball. Oh, Ireland's call from McDonough. Now, 
McDonough needs to end this. Two count and a kick out. No one saw that coming. I can't believe that this whole arena's in shock. Yeah, but no one's more shocked than the man who thought he had a pinfall. The next big move might end. Here we go. What a close line. And now JD playing the intimidation game with his opponent. Nice Japanese arm drag. He's in a little bit of trouble now. There's been plenty of action in this match, and the cost of that is really showing now. Up across the shoulders. Right into a spine buster. Waller really thinks he's something, huh? Oh, look out. The old Ireland's call. And imagine if his own move leads to his downfall. Try to end it. And that'll finally do it. What a victory. That match deserves another look, folks. the winner really at any point during this match. That just made it even more exciting, Saxton, and that is what it's all about. Joined the main event scene there and is doing the best work of his career. Always oh, had the athleticism, but now he has a drive like never before. Time for Cruz to execute on his vision. I just hope he can do that without bleeding from his eyes. The czar of WWE, Ilya Dragunov. hitting competitors in NXT history. A man who's ready to unleash fury on the entire WWE roster. Yeah. Oh. Hey, this dude's been called the unstoppable czar. A title of it he has earned due to his supreme physical conditioning. We've also learned that Ilya Dragunov has a volatile temper inside the ring. You're right, Byron. That's a trait that Dragunov has used to his advantage. Uh, there is no putting out the fire that burns inside of Dragunov. Ilya 
Dragunov ready to bring his aggressive style to his opponent here tonight. Dragunov has to be one of the toughest competitors in WWE. We're going to see here. The wheels uh -oh. are turning. Here we go. All the uh -oh. way. Suicide dive. That's finding any which way to topple the competition. Hurling your own body like that is insane. Uh oh, and a suplex. I don't know. If this is a good idea. This is going to take more strength than he has left. A lift up power bomb. Oh man. Leg breaker! Those bright ambitions of Apollo Crews got sidelined for a moment by that attack. And there was that aggressive offensive style of Dragunov on full display. He's heading up top. Thinking big. Soaring. Able to get out of the way. Power slam. Ilya Dragunov has such an incredible fighting spirit. Is that enough to bring him the victory? Absolutely, Cole. Dragunov leaves everything he has in the ring. And if he brings that intensity and ferociousness to bear, there aren't many superstars he can't find a way to defeat. Boom! Dragunov thinking big. Up high! What? Big time risk pays off. The daredevil in you comes out when you take risks like that. Comes crashing down. He's getting pushed out of the defensive. And the intensity in every move Dragunov delivers doesn't seem to be wavering one bit. Great strength being shown here. <laughs> My goodness! Oh. And he gets delivered back into the ring. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. <laughs> getting carried around. Bad spot to be in. Battling ringside and our announce table's getting shaky. That's because Byron is quivering in fear next to me. Well, I get nervous when the fight comes out here, guys. Book, head scissor take for the victory here. Shoulders up before two. He's still got more left in the tank. Okay, consider that a harsh lesson. He's got more fight in him than a junkyard dog. Oh, what a clothesline. He's absorbed some damage already. Here's the pump handle. Suplex! Launched. Drop kick right on point. Ilya Dragunov getting all sorts of fired up to deliver. And he's able to fight Dragunov off. Look at uh oh! Dragunov is out of the way. Holy moly, what a lariat by Dragunov. You saw that fire in Ilya's eyes as he delivered that move. The Ilya Dragunov getting fired up in the corner. Eyes locked on his opponent. Torpedo Moscow. Dragunov might just have it. Makes the cover. Man, that has got to feel good. Sweet, sweet victory. And here's another look at what made that match so special. They went the extra mile in this win. I agree, what a win. Well, Apollo didn't have it going on here tonight.
Here comes a tough as nails Hall of Famer. We're about to see a fight. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Warner Robins, Georgia. Weighing in at 275 pounds. From college football Hall of Famer to WWE Hall of Famer, his entire career has been based on dominance. One of the most powerful superstars in history. And his opponent from Manchester, England, weighing in at 260 pounds, the British Bulldog, Davy Boy Smith. An all-time great and the pride of England. The British Bulldog, one of the most powerful wrestlers in the history of WWE. Think back to WrestleMania 2 when he won the tag team titles as part of the British Bulldogs. And since then, he's gone on to win the Intercontinental title, the European title, even become a hardcore champion. Speaking of, Byron, have you been housebroken yet? A dominant athlete and true pioneer, Farouk has always succeeded in his athletic endeavors. Most noted for his tag team titles, Farouk has also been successful as a singles competitor. Not only a WWE Hall of Famer, Farouk is also recognized as the first black world heavyweight champion. Farouk's physical command is what... A bear hug, squeezing the breath out of him. I think he's got it locked in good. I just don't know how... Bear hug! Well placed elbow! We'll get you out of it. That might be enough. Yes, it is! Close line! They're stomping away, and repeated impacts like that will weaken you mentally as much as it does physically. This could do it! He got the shoulder up in time. This is where great cardio makes all the difference, helping you stay alive deep into the match. Saving us from having to sit through that. Farouk gets reversed. Ooh! Just hot shot it to the outside. Taking a trip outside, but he's got to be mindful of the count. Farouk sidesteps. If the British Bulldog is going to win this thing, he needs to set the terms of this match in his favor. That means keeping it in the center of the ring and focusing on his grappling skills. Good call, Corey. A more traditional pace and style certainly would play to the Bulldog's strengths. This is punch. Fight is so close to our announce table. Yeah, I'm just going to step aside now. Hey, wait for me. Suplex. And he tosses him back in now. Looking for it. Back body drop. Oh, and a spine bar. And there's the cover. Yeah, no. He doesn't get the three. A long two and a half in the waning moments of this match. He's been placed in the corner now. He's returning fire. Farouk has absolute destruction in mind with that. 
Start counting, Saxton. One, two, three. We could be here four. all day. Power. I think you're right. Rotating verticals. And the cover for the win. It's over. All in a nice work. We've got some highlights from the last one queued up. Here we go. Here is your winner, the British Bulldog, Davey Boy Smith. Wrestle perhaps the perfect match. Never any doubt in this win. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Barely even broke a sweat. as a team. Yeah, all thanks to a little twin magic. Bree and Nikki Bella about to show why they are the greatest women's tag team in history. NXT. And you can guarantee that the rest of WWE is next. And their opponents, accompanied by Man D. Rose, JC Jane, and Gigi Dolan. Toxic Attraction! There has never been a women's faction this dominant in NXT. at the top of their game. Yeah, three great competitors on their own, but together, they are dominating the women's division. A tag match the WWE Universe has been salivating for. And here you see Brie Bella. And Nikki Bella. And standing across from them, it's a very tough test with JC Jane and Gigi Dolan. It is going to be all about teamwork and partnership here tonight. Who will be the better team? Who will have the better chemistry? I personally cannot wait to find out. Running Hurricane Rana. Fantastic. Oh, there's an arm breaker. Right to she covers for the pin. And she breaks the count. This match continues on. Tag made. She's in. Drop kick right to the knee. Right on the patella. With the tag is Nikki Bella. Some attitude. 
Nikki Bella setting it up. Nikki Bella feeding off the crowd, feeding off their energy. does it better absolutely throwing all caution to the wind spinning in the face of danger Ooh, neck breaker and oh what a lariat Ooh, she responds with a counter nice side headlock applied oh what a good measure Jane giving a venomous look to her competition. Wow, what timing beats the count. Seemed like a count out to me, guys. Denied with an elbow. Face first with a waist lock takedown. Hooked up. DDT! Uh-oh, this is just vicious. Arm stop! JC Jane, chicken wing! Face buster by JC Jane for the win! This match is getting pushed beyond the normal limits. Tagged in. Oh, jeez. Falling hard to the outside. Ooh. 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 Jumping snapmare. What a move. Nikki Bella traps the arm. STO. This isn't going to be pretty. Hangman's neck break. Oh, gosh. Uh-oh. Nikki Bella counters. Oh, my God. Wow, what a move. to drive. Dolan just mocking her opponent here. Come on! No one likes a count out. She was a millisecond away from a count out, guys. Boom! Tag. Sent out to the middle. Oh, team! Yeah. Super kick! On the mark. Things not going how she'd like. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Got the tag. Got the tag. Over and over. Big splash. Lives to fight another day. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Oh, look at this. Look at this. DDT. And gets tossed back into the mat. I think someone's about to go Bree mode in this one. And she makes it to her partner. Tag. Roadhouse kick. Man. Tag is made and here we go. She's starting to tire a little. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. She's going for it. She gets the shoulder up. Getting dangerously close to ending it all there. And she'll make the tag. Nikki Bella has her sized up. Display of power by Nikki Bella. The racket. Nikki Bella can taste victory now. Cover! There's two! 
Oh, man. Stomping. Ouch. Bodies must be writhing in pain right now. The breaking point must be on the horizon. But yet they continue forward, showing no desire to quit. Landing on top of the skull. refuses to go quietly. She wants to keep fighting. And you see a perplexed look now for how such impactful offense couldn't gain a pinfall. From the top, she avoids the attack completely. Bionic elbow driven down. Oh, across the top rope. Plenty of hits coming her way now. right back on Nikki. Right. And J.C. Jane gets all of the discus big boot. That has Nikki counting the lights. Two. And that'll be it. Finally a victory. What a hard-fought win. Let's take another look at these ladies going toe-to-toe. Victory for your winners. An impressive effort from this duo. Chemistry on point. Teamwork looking sharp. For my money, this is the best women's tag team around. more dangerous than Roddy Piper with his ring gear on is Roddy Piper with a mic in his hand. You take a man down with words before the bell even rings. Roddy Piper has made a career out of that. A master manipulator. Expect the unexpected when Hot Rod comes to town. Hulkamaniac secretly liked the hot rod. I know you did, Byron. I admit it. I had a soft spot for Roddy Piper. A genius high flyer. Axiom was so fun to watch. And his opponents, first from Madrid, Spain. Weighing in at 154 pounds, Axiom! Well, as a child, Axiom was consumed by comic books and wondered if he could become a hero himself as a grown-up. Is that even a grown-up? I think there's a kid under that mask. Time to see if the calculations are correct for Axiom. held the WWE Championship for 2,803 days. That's seven years, eight months, and one day. 
the WWE Universe showing their love for the living legend. And that legend will grow even more tonight. Here comes the Hall of Fame Phenom. The most intimidating and imposing competitor in WWE history. And one of the most awe-inspiring entrances in all of sports entertainment. And from Death Valley, weighing in at 309 pounds, the The creatures of the night are out in full force tonight. Representing an unbreakable bond that the dead man has had with the WWE Universe for over three decades. I've seen this walk for 25 years, and I'm always in awe. The Undertaker transcends eras transcends sports entertainment. A true phenom in every sense of the word. Decades of dominance. The dead man's wrath is unending. An unspeakable reign of terror over the WWE. And this is the moment where there is no turning back for The Undertaker's opponent. Welcome to damnation. Fatal four-way match underway. This should be interesting. In each corner, you see Roddy Piper, Axiom, Bruno San Martino, and Undertaker. You're really looking to test your metal as a WWE superstar. A fatal four-way is a pretty good way to do it. And that definitely made solid impact. Blasted by a forearm. Yeah. Oh, flapjack. Gosh, landing face first. Shoulders down. Broken up. And the match continues. That's teamwork. And Lock takeover. Slowing down the pace. Tremendous pressure on the head and neck. Ooh. He's got one thing on his mind with that chair, and it has nothing to do with lounging. Face Buster plants him. Held in a perilous position. Oh, what a Given the no disqualification modifier on this match, Corey, what kind of tactics should you expect to see here? Ruthless tactics, Cole. Now is the time for these superstars to unleash their pent-up aggression and be as violent as they want. There's nothing the ref can do about it, so they should go all out. Oh, sharp knee. He's getting a little batter now. Perched up top. Axiom sensed that was coming. Trying their opponent's arm on. Carefully measured double stop. Flawless takedown. 
Ooh. Look at him now. He realizes he's holding the great equalizer. Oh, look at the squeeze. It's on like a vice grip. Oh, that just looks nasty. Oh, my gosh. One wicked attack after another. Big overhand. Oh, that's just an agitating thing to do. Double team effort. Double backbreaker. Very nice. Oh, yeah. Axiom stepping up. Seems more like he's stepping in it. Whip back into the ring. <laughs> oh, target acquired and destroyed. Side headlock applied. Oh, and a right hand for good measure. He knew that was coming. There's the arm ringer. And now he's looking to lock in this submission. Undertaker retaliates. The official ass. He breaks up the hold. He's taking this to the floor now. He's starting to struggle here. Yeah, this fatal four-way has certainly taken its toll, Michael. Elbow drop. Pearson. He's gone for the pin. This could be it. Still only got one. Unbelievable display of will in the late stages of this matchup. Drives a foot into the stomach. Black drop for the pin and the win. Yes, a defiant kick out after one. There is no quit in this man tonight. He clearly has dangerous intentions in mind here, gentlemen. Escape just in time. Bruno is really fired up now, standing tall against him. Uh oh, flashback. And the pressure being put on the phenom there. Well, this deep into a fatal four-way match, you've got to expect to be a little worse for wear. Stiff kick. He's certainly lining him up, but he's wasting too much time. 300 pound running DDT. Into the barricade. Setting up for something here. Left hammer right to the gut. Oh, this is bad. Hot Rod is bleeding. Got it. Like that slice hammer can cause some serious damage. And these attacks are spelling nothing but trouble. Oh! Punch right to the face! Sit straight into the barricade. What's he open to find down there? Oh man, ladies and gentlemen, batter up. Face buster! Getting dangerously close to our desk. That's it. I'm out of here. We might be close to the end. This is getting hard to watch, guys. We might need to stop this one. Oh. Headlock. Oh, and cheap shot right above the eye. Now would be the time for everyone to clear out. Easier said than done. They are not concerned about anyone else's well-being. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. And now gets tossed into the ring. And, oh my God, what a fall! Oh, big punch to the body. And the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Ooh. Oh, what a clothesline. Forcefully delivered. Uh-oh. He turns it around. Planted. Running Bulldog. This one is headed outside, guys. 
Outside the ring now. He has no need to rush. And look at this now. Bad intentions coming with this hole. This match is spilled out to the ringside area. And as we can see, tension's really running high now. Uh, yeah, we should probably clear the way, guys. And he breaks the hold. Oh, yeah. Axiom stepping up. Seems more like he's stepping in it. These competitors have been going deep into their arsenal. Oh. Sleeper hold cinched in deep. And breaks out of the sleeper. Oh. Axiom finds the golden ratio. Axiom might have him for the win. There's two. And there's the win. Huge win here tonight. And here's another peek at some of the more memorable parts of the match. the winner of this fatal four-way match, ladies and gentlemen. This was a hectic match, so bravo to the winner. It certainly took guts and quick thinking to earn the victory. to be moments away from an explosion of offense from Goldberg. rage and an endless appetite for destruction. A man who thrives in hostile environments and can take you out with one move. The incomparable Goldberg clearly ready for action. Always is. You have to imagine he always will be. Intensity, explosiveness, aggression. When you think of Goldberg, you cannot help but think any combination of those three words. Honestly, Byron, those words might just be understating what Goldberg... Will it be? Stopping the refs count at two. Both competitors digging deep into their well to keep this match going. Their opponent, like they're nothing. 
Corey, it has to be hard for anyone to enter. Kohina clutch! Kohina clutch! Kohina clutches in. Time to go night night. After everything, these two men. Kohina clutch, nowhere to go, but there is a way to break it. Oh, man. Bam! Down he goes. And for all of his experience, Kurt looked outclassed there. Yeah, we all know that was just a taste of the explosiveness of Goldberg. And again! Kurt Angle in need of a reprieve. Yeah. Smooth transition. Beautiful takedown into the knee bar. The Olympic gold medalist beat. Boot to the face will free him. Wait a minute, setting in. Devastating submission coming. In trouble, in the grasp. Give up now. Swallow your pride and submit. Just hang on. Hang on for just... Oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. Kurt Angle landed it right there. Ooh, vicious. Boom! Did you hear the impact? Kokina clutch! Kokina clutch is in! Time to go night-night! Oh, just tap out. The clutch is in, this one could be over! Uh, breaking the grip, breaking the grip, breaking the hole! He's going for the pin, this could be it! Oh. Shoulder shoots up before two. There is no quit in this man tonight. This could be the beginning of the end. Goldberg! things. Two! An emphatic victory. We've got some time to take another look at some of the highlights from that one. Here is your winner. Goldberg! No other way to put it, guys. That was kind of a butt-kicking. An absolute statement by the victor here tonight. What a steamrolling. From WWE's biggest hero, the WCW's biggest villain. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the NWO from Hollywood, California, weighing in at 302 pounds. Hollywood Hogan! Hollywood has worn many hats. Icon. Savior, master manipulator. Yeah, and Hollywood Hulk Hogan has also become obsessed with power and driven by placing the industry's heroes in major jeopardy. This industry only has room for one icon, one hero, and we are looking at him right now. Looking to take over even more of WWE tonight. A superstar who has headlined everything from Starcade to WrestleMania. Every move he makes is history making. Amidst 
launching movie franchises, owning a football league, launching countless products, and so much more. The Rock truly does it like no one ever before. It is always a special moment when the great one comes home to WWE to lay it to smack it down. A third generation superstar who honors his family starting all the way at the top with the high chief, Peter Maivia. Without a doubt, furthering his family's legacy in sports entertainment and cementing his own spot on the WWE Mount Rushmore. His greatness transcends eras in WWE history. Powered up in the Iron Paradise, Team Bring It is a lifestyle. Ladies and gentlemen, the most electrifying man in sports entertainment. The Rock set for action here tonight. Yeah, it looks like we're about to see some boots to asses here in this one, Cole. The Great One is here to remind everyone just how dominant he is within the squared circle, not just out of it. We're in for quite the show with this one, folks. And with Hollywood, I'm pretty sure he cares more about his air guitaring and showboating than he actually does about the match itself. Hey, now, he's still the Hulkster, Saxton. He can turn it on when he needs to. Don't get it twisted. And that DDT was well delivered. Hoist it up. Suplex! The Rock telling his opponent to get the... Oh, look at the start of this. Could be going into the playbook for submission. The Bravo Ball! The Rock, can he hold... Abdominal stretch. Fighting out of That's it. That's one way to get out of it. The Rock reminding us all once again that we are watching the most electrifying man in sports entertainment at work. to the cranium. Look, The Rock is absolutely the great one, but if he has one weakness, it's that he has a habit of underestimating his opponents because of said great one status. That sounds like exactly the type of thing you can and should exploit if you're standing across the ring from The Rock. And a Oof. stomp to the gut, too. The Rock is heading up top. Up high! Whoa, look out! Showing absolutely no apprehension to putting one's body on the line. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. How's that for a counter? Whatever's planned here can't be good. Boom, what impact! And now thrown back into the ring. Hoist it up. Oh, that'll knock the wind out. Oh, headbutt to the groin. Oh, that was low. Gonna take a lot of strength to pull this off. So powerful. He just barely dodges. These two battling to a dead heat with these reversals. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Oh, this could do it! Almost ended it there. Obviously still has some fight left. It's a rather crude facial reconstruction. That's not very nice. That's not right. And punch 
stretches. This superstar could go all day. Oh, my God. It's demoralizing to see The Rock in trouble here. And he used the fact that The Rock was clearly underestimating him to his advantage. Now look at him on the upswing. Oh, and I rake. That's not right, but effective. Put into the corner now. Wicked clothesline. Hold on a second. He might be finding a submission hold here. Abdominal stretch. It's locked in. This is a great way to wear down your opponent. Uh, this one's over. Tap out. He better think of a quick count. Oh, wait a minute. There it is. That's a counter with style. He's got the answer for that one. Ooh. Oh, what a punch. That's how you stop. for even one at this point. Hogan's got to be looking deep in himself, asking what will it take to get that three count. It's been the superstar is digging down deep. This superstar giving themselves a major chance. He may get the three count right here. This is it. No, stops the count at two. How? How? Rock lands him with a spine buster. The Rock bringing out the electricity. Reminding everyone just why he's called the Great One. Now a perfect vertical suplex. Oh, just gouging the face. Ripping and tearing at the face. The close of this match is just ahead. I don't want to say he's done, but I... The Hulkster with a body slam. We know what comes next. Leg drop. The Hulkster could have this one. That's got to be it. Two. And Hollywood Hogan picks up the win. Now is a good time to look at some of the highlights from that last matchup. definitely got the job done tonight. It's a good thing The Rock has a second career in Hollywood because he didn't look ring ready tonight. the best women strikers in WWE, Nikita Lyons. The following is scheduled for one fall, making her way to the ring from Las Vegas, Nevada, Nikita MMA trained at a black belt in Taekwondo at eight years old. <laughs> There's another eight-year-old that could beat you up, Saxton. Simply known as the Billion Dollar Princess. And accompanied by Triple H from Greenwich, Connecticut, Stephanie McMahon. Well, here's a woman who absolutely commands respect. It seems like Stephanie McMahon is staring daggers into the WWE Universe. And in a matter of moments, the entire WWE Universe will feel the wrath of the boss. The baddest slap in the business.
She is the most powerful woman in all of sports entertainment. Always ready to battle in the boardroom and the ring. One of the hardest hitting women in the WWE, Nikita Lyons, looking to impress here tonight. When you consider her size and strength, coupled with her martial arts background, it's no surprise why Nikita has seen so much success early in her WWE career. Yeah, Byron, I'll expect we'll see her use everything in her bag against her opponent. And then you have the incomparable Stephanie McMahon, a woman who is just as intimidating in the ring as she is in the boardroom. No doubt, Stephanie is a force to be reckoned with. You mess with the wrath of a McMahon, and you're in for trouble. DDT! Boom! And a big boot! Oh dear, this doesn't look good. Ouch! That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Wait, wait, is she? Yep, looking for the submission. An uncanny showing of power. This would be an amazing upset. Can she get her? Trying to slip out, she did it. Oh man, by the hair. And a whip. Nikita Lyons is one of the most physically impressive superstars in the women's locker room. Corey, how do you formulate? Will it be? And she breaks the count. She is not done yet. Got their opponent set up. Oh, <laughs> drop kick to the back. Big. She's looking for the win. Kick out just before two. Somehow still in this fight. Not down and out yet. Stephanie McMahon in all her endless. Oh, look at this. Is it enough to get back in this match? Wow. So far, so good. DDT! The better part of Valor. Uh-oh. Oh, just completely off target there. Now that was a harebrained idea to try that. Was trying to find a way to attack, but completely wiped out. Just won't stay down. Bad spot for Steph. Nikita Lyons, split leg, leg drop. Can Nikita close things out? Cover. An emphatic victory. Now let's get another look at some of the high points of that one. This was as dominant a win as I've ever seen, guys. As always, Cole, you're more polite than I am, so I'll just say what we're all...